Right. What's up, everybody? So I'm watching the news this morning, and there's all this stuff, this controversy about some Spanish lady putting her dog in an overhead bin. Clearly, United had found that they had the dog in an overhead carrying thing, and they still let the dog die. I'm a big, big dog lover, man. You pay the money to bring your dog on a flight, you should be able to put your dog wherever the hell you want to put it. Period. And if you don't understand the passengers when you're a flight attendant, then maybe your ass shouldn't be a fucking flight attendant. Or maybe you should learn some new languages because there's 50 some odd states. That could be 50 some odd different languages. Granted, most of them are all the same, but still. Learn some fucking Spanish. Learn some German. Learn some shit. To understand our passengers when they're pleading to you. United Airline, fuck you guys. United has apologized again and has accepted full responsibility. The airline says the flight attendant didn't know a dog was inside the bag, but now the dog's owner says that's just not true, insisting she pleaded with the flight attendant not to put the puppy in the bed. This morning, Catalina Robledo is contradicting United's claims that a flight attendant didn't know her puppy named Coquito was inside a carry-on bag. Robledo had paid $200 to bring the black French bulldog on board and initially placed the dog carrier underneath the seat in front of her. But a flight attendant insisted the bag needed to go in the overhead luggage bin. Robledo telling Telemundo, I said to her, how am I going to put my dog where the luggage goes? It's going to suffocate. No dog goes there. She helped put it up there because the dog was heavy and she closed it. In a statement, United says, we have learned that the customer did tell the flight attendant that there was a dog in the carrier. However, our flight attendant did not hear or understand her and did not knowingly place the dog in the overhead bin. But nearby passengers said they did understand. It was very clear to me that she was articulating that there was a dog in, in that carrier. Coquito stayed in the bin the entire flight, which encountered heavy turbulence, at first barking, then silent. Once on the ground, the family found the puppy had died. She took the mile and she was Coquito, 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 Coquito. That's ridiculous. At Chicago.